Well, hello, what's going on, fam? Welcome back to another episode of Grind to Grow. Grind to Grow. What does that mean? I took, I took, I got <laughs> the word, or I started using the word grind after listening to best motivational speaker out there, Eric Thomas. He's very in your face, which I like it. That's my kind of, my kind of talk, my kind of, uh, uh, kind of fire that I need under me to get going. It, it, it I, I like it, all right? Some people need, everybody's different, all right? That's just me. That's uh, uh, the kind of uh, talk motivation that I need. And he said in order to, you know, make things happen. You gotta grind, you gotta put in the time, the, the energy, you gotta be disciplined and show up every single day and get it done. And one thing that uh, stayed with me from the, the, the first day I heard, it, I heard him say this was, <clears throat> like, what do you want? What do you want in your life, in your business, in your marriage, in your relationships, and, and, and what do you want? Like, how much money do you wanna make a year like what do you want stop waking up like an accident and I feel like a lot of people have no idea of what they want in life if you ask them like so what are you working towards like what do you want what are your fitness goals what you know like not telling you to give me all the details of your process because I don't even tell people what I'm doing you know there's you know they kind of know a little bit but like, do you know where you're headed to? Do you know what the, the, the product looks like? And many people can't tell you. Many people have no idea. And, and, and I think because people are too overwhelmed with other things, they're just like, I just need to show up and do this. And, and a lot of people need that. A lot of people, especially in fitness, I've noticed that where people um, kind of not really here you know, not, not really fully present because they got so much going on, um, which that's another topic. But um, when he said that, 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 that uh, I love how he, he said it, like, you, you can't just, you know, ex expecting to, to, to happen. You got to make things happen. If you want to build this company, make this much money, we'll break it down. Right, like, w what are you doing? Um, so if you have a chance to go check out Eric Thomas, go, 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 go check it out. Listen to him. Um, it'll, it'll get you going. Uh, so the other day I was uh, talking to a fellow trainer. He got done training his client and I was doing my workout. And he was like, hey man, how's it going? How's the workout going? Your training going? And I was just like, eh, it's all right which I shouldn't have done it because um, because of what he said after. He's like, man, you, 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 you're still able to move. You are, you know, you can still show up and, 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 and work. Like, you know, this is just, uh, um, I can't remember which word he used, but this is just a, a, a uh, a stage or, or a phase of the process and you know you'll get back to it and it's super positive that he comes in to train and just you know high energy just ready to go excited to see his clients um, just enjoying the the job not saying that I don't I do but um, so I have a a, uh, a habit of I'm making a I'm, I'm working on this uh, uh, creating a better habit of not complaining even on the face of adversity adversity I can't say that word very good <laughs> and I heard I saw this quote with uh, one of uh, an, an athlete that I follow he said. Because uh, asking like, what are you always smiling? What you don't? We never see you angry or mad, or, 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 or even though you like, you know, sleep deprived and, and, and this and that. And he's like, um, 
uh, a smile uh, through the face of adversary. And I think that's a skill that you have to train so much to develop it. Uh, you know, not, not saying that you're never gonna be angry, you're never gonna have, you know, you're ne never gonna be down or just annoyed or just like, I don't wanna do this, I don't wanna be here, I don't wanna talk to this person. Like, oh, like, no, 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 but you, you do have to, you know, think about what you're gonna say or how you're gonna react when you're doing something, going through something where somebody's asking you something. And, and, and uh, it stuck with me. And I told myself, okay, even though I can't work out the way I want to work out because, and I made a, uh, I made a joke about, well, my injuries, all my previous injuries are catching up with me right now. So my body and God is telling me, you need to slow down. It's time to really, really reassess what you're doing and really ask yourself, is it really important for you to compete? Is it really, do you need to do this right now? Are you, like, why are you doing this? So I've been asking myself, I was asking myself those questions. And I, uh, you know, I, did, I came to the conclusion that the, right now, I don't need to do that. It's, 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 it's I, I told myself, it's not my time. Okay, it's not my time. So I, I, you know, made the decision to to really focus on building, rebuilding my body. Um, and then it's not so much looks, but it's more performance. Because yeah, looks are great. You know. It, it, I do, you do, I do want to look like I train because, you know, that shows that I put in the time and, and that's, you know, clients see that. They're like, oh, okay, you know, he, does, he doesn't just tell us to eat right or, or to train hard. Like he's actually doing it because he looks um, uh, like he, he works out. Uh, but for me, it's, a lot of it is performance and being able to move uh, 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 well without being in pain and, and recover so I can do this again uh, the next day and the next day and the next week and so on. So uh, I do, I call it boring workouts. They're not boring. There's a lot of, there's a, <laughs> there's a lot of slow repetitions with very little weight. And I'm not saying that I was like pushing crazy amounts before, no, I'm not. Uh, but there's things that I used to do like a month, two months ago that I, there was just a lot of enjoyment while doing it that I can't do that right now. Uh, but, you know, it, 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 it's right now, it's, it's not the time. Uh, I've told myself every morning this week, do what you need to do. Do what your body is asking you to do right now because, and even though you do want to compete, you do want to do all this, uh, for me, fun workouts, training, you know, right now, you, you, it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. Um, what is it going to happen throughout these next six months, nine months of, of rebuilding and, and strengthening the body and fixing what needs to be fixed? Am I going to discover other injuries or so other things that happen? I do not know, but I will. I will do. I will do my best to smile at whatever obstacle comes my way and... I will continue to assess every single day what I'm doing and be thankful that I can do this, that I can, I can do what I love and I can continue to help people and see them succeed. Because that's the job. That's the main goal as a, as a, as a coach. And, and learn as much as I can throughout this process and put it in practice with not just myself, but clients and, 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 and share with other people who might be going through the same thing. So 
Yeah, yeah. Uh, it was uh, it, it it was great to to to, to hear that from another from another coach because we all have to we've all got it we've all injured ourselves we've all had setbacks and even though this one is a it's a really heavy one both physically and mentally I'm having to to do a lot of self talk and and but affirming myself that you know what yeah this is gonna you have to do this for the next six nine months or maybe a year but imagine how strong and how much how many things you're gonna be able to do and how much how is your performance gonna be a year from today so that's my challenge that is my gonna be my grind every single day so i can grow and become a better Fill in the blank. What is your grind? Peace.